Alright, got a bit of an apology to make. Um, I recorded this entire episode and didn't press record. So, basically, we have already got the red brick, we've got full status, and we've got 10 canisters. Um, I don't want to just skip on to the next one. I like completion. So what we're going to do is I'm going to run through this level really, really quickly. It'll hopefully be a short episode. I'll maybe show where some of the canisters were and uh, just talk a wee bit about this level. Uh, one, of, one or two of the funny things I never realised until today when I did it. And uh, yeah, was that a canister? I don't actually remember. Oh, no, it was a canister on top. That that. Um, so instead of a canister, if you've already got a canister, usually it just shows a, a blue stud. So that was a canister up top. All right, so we've got another one of those pillars there. Uh, a canister does appear on top of that, which you can only get if you build all these um, gun things. Uh, I think I, I think I already had that one as well. Uh, it's a fairly easy one to get because you generally you need to build these anyway. All right, there we go. So that would give us yeah a canister up there, uh, but it didn't because we already have that one. Thanks to my muck up. Alright, let's just do all that. Uh, funny thing to note is if you look, there was also a canister off. It's like walk the plank, isn't it? <laughs> there was a, there was a canister off there as well. But as you can see uh, to the mid left of your screen, there is the um, oh, what's the name of? It? I, I I never actually stated the name, but that's the pet with the creature in it. Uh, the the Kraken of Star Wars. Release the Kraken. So yeah, now we need to fight giant uh, Boba, who has decided to send people in to protect him. Not that it did much good. We killed him. And now the aircrafts are going to collide. Hey, greetings boys. Now this next bit was somewhere I have been before, but I completely forgot about it. This is a double score zone, uh, as you can see, so times 16 instead of times 8 as usual. You can see the Kraken down there, whatever it's called. Um, and then, in order to get the canister, all you have to do is... Well, first of all, you have to pull those levers, and it just gave you that. Which, it just gave you cash, and it was like, oh, that's kind of lame. So then I... No, I didn't do that. I shot that, and it gave me that. And you just build that. And hey, presto! Canister. Not really. Um, but before there was a canister. Uh, and then I went round there, and there was another canister uh, along that corridor. I'm not going to go for it just yet, but basically, as you can see up there, there is a, a blue stud. That was where the canister was based. Now, uh, this canister was a wee bit strange. I'll show that off in just a bit as I can get up here. As you can see, there's three levers. We need this guy to come up. Come on. There we go. What? Ah, oh, come on. You had this problem before. Change into someone different. Yeah, just change into Darth Vader. Alright, there we go. Okay, we're all up. So basically what you do is you just pull one lever, he pulls one lever, and then you force the other lever. And that gives you the canister, which is represented by that blue thing. I think that's only a Sith can, yeah, as you see it's got the red particles around it. So only a Sith can actually pull the lever on the left. Now for absolute chaos. Excellent. This is actually, it's one of my favourite parts of the film and one of my favourite levels in the game. Really enjoy playing it. Uh, let's just destroy that. And run into a load of gunfire. Not that it makes a difference. Now for the most unsafe elevator of all time. Uh, and then through in the back here. Oh yeah, I thought there was a canister here. I don't think there was actually. I mean, maybe there was and I already got it. Uh, if we just wander in here. Yeah, I'm not convinced there was. There was. It was just a. Uh, it was just uh, a room full of studs. That's basically it. As proven. I mean, that blue thing wasn't a canister, unless I got that before. But I don't think you can get into this room in free play. You need a thermal detonator. And don't think that's provided. And that's the disco, the silent disco. Uh, we'll let those guys enjoy it. And now I'm going to pan your windies in. This is what goes on in regularly. Actually, I'm going to edit that out. <laughs> that was... yeah. Anyway. <laughs> oh, man. That's not a joke for the internet. Uh, right, let's keep going. The reason it's not a joke for the internet is because you don't know who's watching. People say, oh, it's not offensive because no one here would be offended by it. Well, 
I don't know who's watching. Alright, uh, we just need to do this. The red brick. Oh, there was a canister up there. In one of those platforms up there. Actually, when I did this before, uh, I ended up getting 1.1 million studs. And that was when I had. Um, oh! Dude, just please go away. Uh, yeah, I had 1.1 million studs. Which was, uh, I think, a record. Uh, well, not a record. It was, uh, it was pretty good for times 8. Uh, so we'll just do that. Kill, kill these guys. How can they block with an axe? What makes an axe so special? Is it a Jedi axe or something? Ha! Right, we did that. There was a there was a there was a canister like literally down there as well. Uh, I can't display it now because I've already collected the blue stud, but it was down there, I promise. And then there was another canister through that fence there. And I think that was the last one of the level. So let's do that. I mean, to be fair, we're not far off 1.1 uh, 1, uh, 1 million. All right, this is the uh, end of the level, obviously, where R2 has to fill up the... has to load the gun. And we just need to jump on it. And boom, 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 boom. Yeah, there we go. We've completed that level. Great apologies that I couldn't do it legitimately, but hopefully... I just thought I would do it anyway to, to A, fill the episode, which is not really something I would... Like, it's not really part of my philosophy on YouTube, but for the purpose of fulfillment and just general completion, I thought I would do it. Um, and also just to do it again on camera, it's kind of fun. Uh, but yeah, that is that, The Great Pit of Carcoon. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time for Endor.